The first step of creating my curves for my kneeling chair was to rough cut the parts over at the bandsaw. From there I could use my track saw to create two clean flat surfaces for my joinery. And for this one, I'll be using double floating tenons, or more commonly known as dominoes. And the reason I chose dominoes here was because there's a lot of stress on this joint. But I covered some other options in the full video. Now when I was cutting these pieces at the bandsaw, I left some tabs so that I could easily clamp these pieces together. So once the glue had dried, I could just remove those tabs over at the bandsaw. And then from there I could clean up the shapes by flush trimming them over at the router table. And if you want to see how these two legs came together to make this awesome kneeling chair, be sure to check out the full video over on my YouTube channel. And follow for more woodworking tips and tricks. I'll see you next time.